guys. I'm just gonna be doing some of my like cool slash weird stuff today here. You know, I got the little hand stuff right here. So yeah, let's do it. And yeah. Um, first off, I'm just gonna start out with this like it's a 3D printed model of my bottom teeth and this. Oop, I got this when I went to the orthodontist place to get this to get a mouth guard that I needed because if you look closely, um, that right there is grinded down and the other side is too. But this is cool. It's just like a model of my teeth on the bottom. <clears throat> Next, I have Doug Baldwin. I got this when I went to Seattle. Um, yeah, it's a nice card. It's encased in this blue case. You know, Doug Baldwin's box. And then, you know, Walter Payton. Gotta go with the Walter Payton. No, sorry. It's like glaring off my phone. But, yeah, I got this in Seattle too because I went to the flea market there. And my favorite one, Bo Jackson in college. It's a really nice card. You know, it comes in the red casing. Also got it in the flea market. So next I got, it's kind of like three different things here. These are all pointed. Well, here's, first off, I got a trash knife. So basically... I was at this camp place that I really hated, and I wanted to make, like, some kind of, like, stick knife, because it was an outdoor camp, and I used trash I found around the camp, uh, and I attached it to a stick that I found and charmed it against a rock and got a really nice, 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 nice tip, but as you can see, I got the duct tape for my name tag and stuff, but bottle cap, it's really nice. Next, this is from when I went to take a trip to the mountains, and it's like, I don't know what you call it, but you jab it into the side of like a, a hill or something that you're trying to climb up, and it helps you up. I forgot what it's called, but it's useful for that. Next, I have like the first wooden thing that I ever made. Really nice knife that I made a long time ago. 2017, yeah, when I was moving, decided to make this, without using any kind of knives, just made this, really nice, I like it, it's, it's cool, next, I have, I got two more things, I will be making a part two to this video, but next, I have a slingshot, and you gotta be really accurate with this thing, and you have to pull it back, really far, but yes, you can shoot rocks out of it, I've done it before, it's really nice, really nice, 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 I forgot where I got this from, got it uh, when I went hiking somewhere, I bought it, but yeah, it's really nice, I love it, it's a good quality slingshot, you know, put it in your backpack, <laughs> you know, and then last but not least, I got this cool survival bracelet, a to survival. I got this for my birthday last year. And comes with a compass. Working compass. Comes with a ferrocium rod. So you can strike sparks off. With this little blade here. I'm not gonna do it now because it's kinda hard to do it at this angle. And whistle if I haven't already said that. And then you can use the paracord. But yeah, that's pretty cool. Um, that's all my stuff right now. I will post again maybe later today. I know it's like... Gotta check. <laughs> 6.45. But yeah, I'll keep you guys updated. You know, some just weird stuff that I had. And I'll see you guys later. I will make a part two of this video. Peace!